It's quiet. <laughs> Too quiet. Ricky, it's a cave. It's meant to be quiet. But am I supposed to be looking for bumblebee bats? Shouldn't I hear buzzing? No, they call that because they're tiny. About the size of your thumb. But the only sound they make is ultrasonic. It's beyond human hearing. So we're looking for tiny stealth bats. That means I won't be able to see or hear them when they attack me. <laughs> I'm sure they're more scared of you than you are of <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> me, the dark, bats, not a good combination. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> yes, I should go after him. Oh, probably better for the bats too. I shouldn't be too long. In the meantime, try not to get into too much trouble. Trouble? Here in beautiful Thailand? Not likely. Oh. Made some friends? Better than talking to the trees. Who would have thought the Thai jungle would be so jungly? So lacking in civilization. Exactly. Oh, it's awesome. Oh, come on, Ricky. Where's your sense of adventure? Excitement. Oh, Sam, <laughs> check out these monkeys. The way they swing through the trees. Fascinating. Langoa monkeys. They're friendly. And on the plus side, they're not birds. <laughs> a couple came up close before. I should get a photo, a souvenir of my time in the wilderness. And I can enjoy it from my comfy hotel room in Bangkok. <laughs> Careful, they don't call them cheeky monkeys for nothing. Yeah, well, at least they're easy to keep an eye on. Unlike those bumblebee bats. Better hurry, they're going. I phoned, I had it a second ago. I put it down to get a drink, and the monkeys came over. The, the monkeys. monkeys! Oh, the thieves stole my phone. Ugh. Where are you going? To get my phone back. Ricky, come back. Wait, you'll get lost. Ah! Ricky, a word of advice. <laughs> when chasing monkeys through the treetop, it's best to look at your feet every once in a while. Great. Now we've lost the monkeys and my phone. No way. Thank you, whoever's calling me. Don't hang up. That way. Hello, Ricky. It's April. If you're wondering why I'm calling on Sam's phone, it's to let him know that he left it at home. Ha! Could you please let him know that I know how he borrowed my backpack, so I'm going to borrow his phone in the meantime. April, about Karate Camp. Your sensei just rang. He's sick. Karate Camp's been cancelled. But he's a sensei. He's supposed to be like, Fit and healthy. How about we all go out somewhere instead? Uh, just need to get this, it's important. Senator Gruen, thank you for returning my call. We've definitely lost them this time. Uh, give me back my phone! But they haven't lost us. Oh, they're more than just cheeky. They're totally rude! Ricky, accept it. Your phone is gone. I'll give you a banana. <laughs> They're leaf monkeys. I don't eat bananas. Everybody likes a change now and then. My phone! <laughs> ah! 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 Yes, I really don't like bananas. For us! Take that back about them being rude. They're evil. Oh, oh man, that stinks. Oh, it's a durian. It actually tastes okay once you get past the smell. It also makes fantastic ice cream. Uh, I'll take your word for it. Have they come down? I guess they've moved on. Yeah, with my phone too. Seriously, who are they gonna call? Oh no! What is it? Oh, does it stain? No, my camera's gone. What do you mean? You just had it. I oh, know, I put it right there. The, the monkeys! monkeys. It's okay, Sam. Just accept it. Your camera's gone. <sighs> We've lost enough stuff for one day. Let's head back to the cave. <sighs> it's that way. It's this way. It's that way. No, I'm sure it's this way. I'm pretty good with directions. Since when? Since always. I just don't brag about it. Sort of an inner compass thing. I'll scout ahead. So, maybe 
maybe my inner compass thing doesn't work so well in the jungle. I see now why you don't brag about it. <sighs> OK, no phone and no camera to live stream at home. And no idea where we are. Awesome, it's a clearing. And that's a reason for celebration? <laughs> in the jungle, we've got nothing to get our bearings by. At least here we can see the sun, work out which direction we should be heading. That whole navigating by the sun thing, I'm guessing you need to be able to see it. That's usually how it works. Change of plan. Awesome, we've got a tent. It's not a tent, it's a hoochie. What's that? Sort of like a quick tent. Let's make it extra quick. There you have it. Instant shelter. Just add water. It wasn't a request! Ugh. Well, if I can't train, I guess I can watch other people training. I see. And in regard to that new eco-development... Sorry. Yeah, yeah. If you can forward me the plans now, I'm in front of the computer as we speak. Yeah. To cheer up, but nothing is worth. Okay, excuse me a moment. April. Okay, good. Yeah? I've got something. Check this out. Uh -huh. Affirmative agent. Holy fuck, Molly. This is cozy. It's only meant for one. Lucky for you, I'm a sharing, caring kind of guy. Oh, no need to share the stench of your stinky feet as well. It's worse than a durian. I have a grass seed in my sock. Oh, that's reason enough to asphyxiate me. <laughs> I guess it is pretty bad. Bad? That's a weapon of mass destruction. Hey, guys. Agent A reporting for duty. Oh, hi. We thought you had karate camp. So did I. Now I'm free. So I could be a target or wrestle wild animals. Or you. But Agent J and I are on a mission. OK. I can do that. It's highly classified. We can't even tell you what it's about. And, and we've, we've only, only got, got two walkie-talkies. Oh, OK. Later, maybe? Yeah. Sorry. <sighs> What's Sam doing? Streaming anything? Doing. Well, that looks like fun. <sighs> All right, the rain stopped. Good. Because we need to get back to the cave before it gets dark. It's the middle of the day. Hey, well, you don't know how long it's going to take until. Ah! Something bit me. Oh, no. Oh. It's a giant centipede. Centipede? It's this snake with legs. Get in the way. Get in the way. <laughs> I sat away, as in a far distance. Canada wouldn't be far enough. Oh, oh, gone. Oh, I never want to see one of those again. Oh, Not even in documentaries. That can't be good. Nothing good can come out of an insect that big. Wait, insect? Bite you, Sam Fox? Seriously allergic to insects? Technically, it's not an insect. What is it then? An arthropod. And in English? Sort of like an insect. Ah, oh. oh, okay. Serious pain now. OK, not good, not good, not good, not good, not good. Ah. Gotta be here somewhere. Oh, it's bad. That phantom short packs a serious punch. Here, you need to do it. What, me? Jab you? You have I to. Can't. You have to. I'm getting dizzy. You're my best friend. I'll, I'll do anything for you. But... Then do this. I, I can't jab my friend. Get over it, or you won't have a friend for much longer. Oh. Okay, okay. I'll just be like you. Fearless and a little bit crazy. Make sure you take the safety release cap off. Uh. Carefully. Ah, quick, swing and jab into the thigh. Swing and jab. Go! Oh. 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 Oh.
Ricky! Okay, I'm doing it. That's a mug. Hold her there. All right, take it out. I did it. I did it. You did it. Okay. How quickly does it take effect? Pretty much now. Are you going to be all right? I'll be weak, but we need to get back to the cave before it wears off. Yeah. All right. I'll pack up the hoochie and I'll get that in a compass of mine working again, yeah? Looks like navigating by the sun is still out of the question. No offence to you in a compass. None taken. Looks like any footprints we may have left have been washed away. Might be one good thing to come of the rain, though. I'm listening. Exactly, listen. What am I supposed to be hearing? Running water. The river? Exactly. The rain would have raised the river levels. So if we can find the river, I bet we can follow back to find Mum. Whoa, whoa. Side effects from the jab or the bite? Probably both. Lucky me, huh? Here, yeah, give me a pack. Thanks. Let's go. Deep in the Thailand jungle, the mysterious elephant faces its only known enemy. The vicious, terrifying Velociraptor. <laughs> I'm way too old to be doing this. Oh, that doesn't look right. Doesn't sound right either. Come on, come on, come on. Answer this time. Hello, Ricky. It's April. OK. That was weird, even for Ricky. Dad! Can you excuse me a second? I think Sam's in trouble. Are you sure? Well, I know that he's lost his camera and that monkeys have Ricky's phone, so... Well, that sounds expensive and careless, but not necessarily life-threatening. Maybe it's a prank. I don't think so. Will you ring your mother and see what she thinks? Sorry about that. Yes, I've got it in front of me now. So this thing... Hi, this is Laura Fox. Please leave a message and I'll... <sighs> Mom, call me back. It's urgent. Agents, major emergency. Sam and Ricky have lost all their electronic devices, which obviously means something's wrong. And I need your help to figure out what that is. That is, if you're up for it. Copy that, Agent A, I'm up for it. Agent J, are you up for it? Over. 10-4, Agent H, totally up for it. Repeat, totally, over now. Great. Agents, we have our mission. What we need to do is activate the alarm on Ricky's phone. I figure if it went off, it would be so loud and annoying, annoying Ricky, that the monkeys would drop it. And Ricky will hear it and find his phone. Yes, because he'll be following his phone, trying to get it back from the monkeys. But how do we set off his alarm? By logging onto his phone locator. I don't know what software he uses, but I figure it'll be a free one. So I'll try this. It's not that easy. I need a password. Tricky. That's it, Tricky Ricky. Are you sure? Because we only get three guesses until the software shuts down. Game over, huh? Mm, what about... I hate birds. Incorrect. Ricky Hart's Tracy? Gross! <laughs> Incorrect. Last chance. Come on, guys, you need to focus. Drumming! I can't concentrate! Drumming helps me think. I wasn't thinking. I was just drumming. That's it! Music! Ricky's a DJ! Well, so he thinks he is. So what about DJ Ricky? DJ Ricky rocks! Affirmative Agent J! Here he goes. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> now, 
never been so happy to see a river before. Does any of this look familiar to you? Yeah. Yeah, we must be close. Oh, I knew my inner compass would kick in eventually. My, bo my body's telling me I'm running out of time. Oh, here, lean on me. Oh, What's that? Unbelievable! It's my phone! Oh, how lucky is that? Now we can call Laura and get help. Oh. Maybe not so lucky. Oh, of course. We've missed a danger magnet, whose powers obviously haven't weakened. Has it seen us? I'm gonna say yes. And does it look fed to you? Maybe. I can't imagine a crocodile was ever that full that it couldn't eat anything else. Because I really want my phone. I have to talk you into giving me an injection to save my life. As soon as it comes to your phone, you're suddenly Ricky the Lionheart. Do you have any idea how many phones I've lost because of you? It's blowing my budget. You have a budget? Not important. The fact is, your life depends on me getting that phone. Not exactly my life. And I'm pretty sure it's just My turn to be brave, Sam. I need to take a minute. Running, not my friend. What you need is a doctor. <laughs> Definitely. I've been better. We need that phone. But getting it means running the high possibility of becoming lunch. Think, Ricky, think. What is that? Ah! Awesome, it's a flying snake. Not awesome, not even mildly awesome. It's okay, it landed over there. Oh, this isn't Thailand. This is freaky land, tiny bats. Giant centipedes, phone stealing monkeys, and now flying snakes. Calm down, Ricky. Oh, not calm down. I need to get out of here. Back home, finally. Where there may be snakes that can kill you in one bite, but definitely, no buts about it, don't fly. Besides, you need a doctor. You need to get the phone. Stay here. I got this. Hey, Croc. So this is your river, huh? Uh, like what you've done with the place. You're not hungry, are you? Oh, yeah, my bad. You don't speak English, do you? Uh, Sam, what's Thai for? Don't eat me, I come in peace. We can get back here, we don't need the phone. You don't have to be brave, Sam. That's my job. No, really, Ricky, I think the cave- If I die, you can have my DJ set. I want to keep my drumsticks, though. I, I want to be buried with those. OK, OK, OK. Sam, can have my drumsticks? I just want my phone. Ricky, when I say go, I want you to grab the phone, OK? First the allergy pen, now the phone. Ricky the Lionheart. Finally, the two of you are reunited. Uh, mwah. Now I can call Laura. About time, just about the looks of it. I don't think we'll need to. You don't have to be heroic anymore, Sam. Just because you're sick doesn't mean you're not brave. Uh, no, I mean, I'm pretty sure the cave's just around the river bend. Huh? Yeah, we're only five minutes from Mum. But I could be wrong. I'm feeling really sick. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> you should definitely call for help. Yeah. Is the phone working? Kinda. The screen's cracked. Ah, oh, you called. 
Twice. What did you want? I left my phone at home. It could be anyone. I reply anyway. Uh, that's not working. A text from Ricky. What does it say? Grief spa. Do you think it's from a monkey? Text back. Oh, you a monkey. A smiley face. They must be okay. Yes! Hello, strangers. What have you been up to? Just the usual. Oh, high adventure with the odd life-threatening event thrown in? Hey, it's like you were actually there. Details, Sam. Pretty simple. Got bitten by a giant centipede and need to get rushed to hospital. <laughs> you were right. Just the usual. Let's get moving. Hey, you forgot to mention the killer crocodile, flying snake, and evil thieving monkeys, and the fact that I had to stab Sam with an allergy pen. Oh. That's a trauma I'll have to live with for the rest of my life. Oh. Hospital treatment for both of you, then. Come on. Sorry we didn't get your camera back, Sam. Then it's in the bottom of a river. Lying on the ground broken somewhere. Nature has to win sometimes. Yep. Either that or they're making home movies. <laughs> I guess we'll never know.